Hey, hey y'all, and welcome to today's video. It's a grocery haul and day in the life. We're gonna bring you with us through the day. We're gonna go get us some lunch, maybe go to the park because it is a beautiful day and go get the groceries that we need for the week. It is smelling good in this car, but a little bit strong. Uh, the coffee little tree air freshener that I got last week we went to the car wash yesterday and I went ahead and put it in here. I meant to do that a few days ago, but it didn't happen. It happened yesterday though. And we got it. I'm like, Ooh, that smells good, but it's a little strong. Am I the only one? Like I know the little tree suggests that you leave it in the pack and you pull so much of it out. Does anybody do that? Or do you just take the whole thing out of the pack and hang it on the rear view mirror? Cause that's what I do. But it smells good and it's not as strong today as it was yesterday. It smells really good. Huddy said it smells like Starbucks in here. Is everybody buckled? Check. Buckle check. 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 I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Now, there we go. I'm Tiffany, by the way, and this is our small town life. And we are happy to have you here today. We would love for you to subscribe and stick around and be part of our YouTube family. All right, let's get going. Speaking of groceries, I've got a few things that I'm planning to get today for a fun what's for dinner video. I'll tell you more about that here in just a little while. It's something I've been thinking about. It's in my mind for a while and decided it was time to do it. So I'll share more about that with you here in just a little bit. <laughs> Wave at me. <laughs> Y'all, I think it's like 74, feels like 100 today. But I ain't mad about it. I love the warm weather. Let's go, Walmart. All of the Easter stuff has officially changed over to summer stuff. What is it? Uh, $30. But, but these are the bigger ones. I love that. I want a ball. I wanted one of the balls last year, but we never got one. You can get one this year, maybe. What are they? Oh, skipping balls. Yeah. Justice has pool floats. Ages six plus. All different kinds. These old faithful transparent mats for a dollar ninety-eight. You can't tell me your mama wasn't floating around in a pool on one of those transparent mats back in the day. Oh yeah, a splash pad. Little one. Oh yeah, Wyatt would enjoy this one right here too. These are nineteen eighty-eight. There's all kinds of water bottles. I like the way these look. They're matte. Some other colors or some with straws what is this you brew you hmm. I think it's just a cup that they say is good for cold brew and things because you can see in the top of it and it fits in a cup holder cup holder friendly so are these larger ones though and look at that color this oh I like this the boys spotted snow calm makers. It's a personal ice cream maker. What's left of the Easter candy is 50% off. Easter things in general. There's more down there. Do they always have blueberry cobbler? Or is it? Nope. Limited edition. Oh, how Justin would feel about that. Maybe I need to ask him and get it next time. Sounds interesting. Have y'all ever tried it? Let me know. This one says limited edition. Oh, 
they have these freedom vanilla ice cream sandwiches but it's five dollars for four of them they're cute though Bye. 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 home with the groceries y'all we got what we needed for the week now i spent about a hundred dollars this week about 110 dollars actually and if you've been around here then you know i did a big sam's club haul a few weeks ago we still have those things we're still working through those things and I did that big Sam's Club haul and then I set aside about 50 to $75 a week to get fresh produce and milk and those kinds of things. I spent a little bit more this week because I am planning that what's for dinner video. And so I needed some things for a few meals that I had not originally planned for. No big deal. We're working out in the budget. The what's for dinner that I'm talking about is going to be really fun. It's going to be YouTube creator inspired meals. So some of my YouTube friends, some of the YouTubers that I enjoy watching, I am taking some dinners that they've made recently and I'm going to be making them and sharing them with you and letting you know what I think about them. I actually had quite a long list when I started planning out some meals that I wanted to do from different people that I had seen over the last few weeks. And so this may actually end up being a couple of <laughs> videos, maybe once a month we'll do YouTube creator inspired what's for dinner because I did I had quite the long list when I started thinking about what I wanted to try and So the first one of those will be coming up here shortly and I had to get a few things for those meals Oh, and my cheeks are red and I'm a little sweaty. I Feel like we have skipped over spring and moved into summer, which is my favorite season so that is fine but it is nice and toasty today let me show you what we got at walmart i'm actually going to go ahead and show you this frozen stuff and get it put away the boys wanted some of these fudge sticks which is also my favorite and i'm trying to do better about sweets but i may have to have one of these what else is frozen some hash browns and some waffles can I like position myself to hide all the big pile of clothes that's on the couch? It's no big deal. If you see them, you see them. I have clothes I need to fold. Let me get these things put in the freezer and we'll come back and check out the rest of it. Whole milk and chocolate milk and then some chocolate almond milk for Wyatt. Some Dr. Thunders and some root beer. Sandwich bread. Now I have been doing pretty good about making homemade bread. We've got a busy week, y'all. Giving myself a little grace. I still plan to make some bread this week, but also got a loaf of white sandwich bread and some hot dog buns. Now, I got the hot dog buns because I plan to specifically use those for one of those recipes. I wanted to kind of use what she used. So, I got some store-bought hot dog buns. Now, look at this condensation. I'm telling y'all, that's warm outside. Let's see, I got a tomato also for one of the dinners that I'm gonna be doing this week. Ready for some homegrown tomatoes, y'all. <laughs> Tomato plants are in the ground and that makes me happy. Some lettuce, bananas, strawberries, blackberries, and some gold potatoes. That was the chair. Let me just move it out of my way. Easton requested these devil cream cakes and I got some Nutty Buddy bars. We were out of rice, so I got this five pound bag of jasmine rice. We were out of ramen noodles, ramen noodles, ramen noodles. What do y'all call them? Uh, so we got the 12 pack. We just like to have these on hand for feed yourself night. Usually somebody wants those. We needed some more toothpaste. The kids needed more toothpaste and then Justin needed more vitamins. We also needed more cat litter and I used to get these pine pellets quite often. And then I had moved away from them because the cats got a little finicky about them. I'm really hoping that they'll use them again because there's not any dust with these. It absorbs a lot. It's just 100% pure pine pellets. No chemicals, no nothing. I like these. Let's hope I can get the cats to like them. 
I'm just up in here in the dark, you know, acting like I know what I'm doing. Cut some lights on Tiffany. You've done this before. Thank y'all for coming with us today, spending some time with us, and going grocery shopping with us. I will link that Sam's Club haul down in the description box just in case you might be new and you haven't seen it. It might be something you would enjoy, and we would love to have you subscribe and be part of our family around here. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. We love you. We appreciate you. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. <laughs>